the Spice Girl Power! Hi guys, it's Patrick Star. Today I have the Spice Girls. I am Scary Spice. We have Sporty, Baby, Ginger, and Posh Spice. And we are doing the Spice Girls. We hope you guys enjoy that intro. If you guys want to see how we did our look, subscribe to them. I will leave the channels down below. If you guys want to see how I did my Scary Spice look, then keep on watching. Hey guys, it's Patrick Star. Welcome back to my channel. So today, I am Scary Spice. You shall look scary, very scary, mostly <laughs> what, scary. What accent? <laughs> I'm not sure. I think I... South of Wales, I believe. <laughs> I think I mix country in with a little bit of England. Stay where you are. <laughs> So today I bring you Scary Spice Mel B. I am in love with her. She is fabulous and I was looking at pictures of her and she had some grungy, very dark makeup. So I thought I would give you my twist on her makeup and I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial. Be sure to subscribe. Hi there, I'm Scary Spice. And I am the little boy from Stranger Things and you're watching Scary Spice. For the primer, I'm going to take the Too Faced Hangover Primer and apply this all over my face. This allows for a sticky base. This foundation is one of my favorites. It is the Clinique 2-in-1 Beyond Perfecting Foundation and Concealer. It's like a 2-in-1. So you literally get the best of both worlds. And I love it. And it has like a concealer applicator. For concealer, I'm going to use the Urban Decay Weightless Complete Coverage Concealer. This is such a natural skin tone finish. It's an oldie but a goodie. And I thought I would use it today because I love it so much and I'm gonna take my booty blender and I'm just going to twerk the booty blender and blend it and then of course today since I'm dancing so hard as you saw I am going to bake to the gods yes the bake bake to the gods because we cannot bake enough and as far as baking if you guys are more so dry use the powder in moderation I myself am super oily so I can afford to pack on as much powder but if you are more dry use it in moderation so i'm going to take coco bear and frappe by makeup geek and use this as the transition and then i'm going to take the 35 om palette a dark chocolate color and pat this all over the eye lid with a flat brush i realized there was a little bit of fallout as you can see so what i did was i took some loose powder and i used that to catch the fallout just because i did my foundation first if you are a beginner definitely you do your eye makeup first but i just like doing my face first so that's what i did i'm gonna take the transition colors red earth is also a beautiful color by anastasia beverly hills and i'm gonna take this and just smoke this out in the crease to create that smoky, grungy, yet sexy Spice Girl effect. So to keep it true to the 90s, I know eye calls were all the rage. So I thought I would bust out my Urban Decay 24-7 liner in the color, I believe this is Zero or Perversion. One of the black ones. And I'm going to smudge it out underneath my liner. I mean, uh, my lash line and my waterline. And I'm just going to buff that out. Dust off the excess powder. And I'm going to take Red Earth right here. And I'm just going to smudge this underneath the eye. This is just going to allow for that smoky, sultry effect. Very rocker chic. Very scary space. And definitely if you're a guy, like rock this eye look. This eye look can be worn literally for anybody. But in particular for scary spices, this was more so like her signature look. So next we're going to curl the lashes up to Jesus. And use my favorite roller lash mascara for the top. This allows my lashes to stay curled. And then I'm going to apply these lashes by Lily Lashes in this style. Mykonos. These are very full and dramatic, definitely for a special occasion, like Halloween. So if you want some good quality lashes, definitely check it out. I'm going to coat my bottom lashes using my Velvet Noir Mascara by Marc Jacobs. And I'm going to bake um, a foundation powder underneath my eye to get that full coverage effect. Because, you know, this is a more show a showgirl look. Every day is a show for me, so I thought I would just bake some foundation powder and then... Of course, bronze the entire face using a mineralized skin finish by MAC. The mineralized skin finishes are beautiful. They're more so pricey, but it's a great investment to um, purchase powders that are good quality for your face. 
Now for blush, I'm taking this blush called Warm Soul by MAC, using that on the cheek. And then I'm going to snatch my nose using this fan brush. And we're just going to snatch it till you look like you can't breathe. But um, that's what we're going for. And to further snatch the nose, I like to contour this inner part of my eyebrow slash eye slash nose to elongate my face. Because, you know, I'd be looking rough with this wig. I'd be looking real scary, not spicy. So, moving on, I'm going to take the Red Earth eyeshadow and continue to blend underneath the eye for that smoky effect. And moving on to the lips, I'm going to take Rimmel London's Coffee Bean Lip Liner. These are my favorite, favorite lip liners ever. They're so creamy, pigmented, and smooth. And this is such a signature color for Mel B. And it is a very, very coffee color for the lips. And I love this color. You see how pigmented? It's almost like a lipstick. I think that's what I did for the lipstick. Yeah, yeah. That was the color that I ended up using. The whole lip pencil. Very 90s. Now moving on to the brows. I'm taking this Benefit Precisely Brow Pencil in the shade number 4. And lightly stroking some hair-like strokes through the brows. I've been loving this because it's more precise. The other one was very chunky. But, you know, I have my days and my moods. But this is what I wanted to go for. And that should literally complete the scary spice look. If you want to try this, definitely try for any occasion for scary spice for halloween for a sexy witch anything and grab an afro wig that i got from the wig shop down the street mama yes god and that's the look all right everyone i hope you guys enjoyed this video be sure to check out all the other spice girls this is definitely another scary spice i am 40 <laughs> spice so you better itch that wig oh you're an idiot you're an idiot you're an idiot kevin more. <laughs> you have no more powder. Y'all, Scary Spice is going to be looking greasy today. Leave. You ruined my life. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Be sure to subscribe. Let me know what you guys want to see next. Happy Halloween, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.